So, I want to do a video on how not to de-dome an LED. This is my Sunway Man T40CS. It's not one that I use, it's just one that I have. I keep it because it was the first proper flashlight that I got. Um, the other day, sat being bored, took it apart and de-domed the LED. Did a lazy de-dome, didn't do it properly. I just ran the light on high for a few minutes, got it a bit warm and just pulled the dome off with my fingertips. And you probably can't see, but I've taken some of the coating off the LED. So, as a result of that, it's now developed a really nasty purple tint around part of the hot spot. I have got more looks. I've probably doubled the looks out of it, but I've got that horrible tint. If you compare that to my, if I can turn the TK70 back on, if you compare that to my D25C Eagle Tack with an XGP XPG2, I actually de-dome this the same way. I do not recommend de-doming like this because the risk of damaging your LED is pretty high. It should not be de-domed just by flicking off the dome. But, I was fortunate with this one, it did work. And now I have higher looks, but I've got a really nice tint. It's a warmer tint than it was before. So, I did get lucky with that. And then just finally, this is my SR52VN, which has got an XML2 PDT cool light. Obviously with it being one of Vin's lights, it's absolutely clean, D-Dome, he does it properly. Oops. And the tint on this is awesome, obviously very intense hotspot. 